What's up guys, Alex here, GuitarForce.com. So we continue with the series of uh, cool licks played by different guitar players. Today we're going to take a look at Randy Rhodes. Uh, this lick is taken from uh, the chorus section of uh, Crazy Train. The tuning is going to be standard, so without further ado, let's go for the close-up and start the lesson. Alright, so this lick is taken from the chorus section of Crazy Train, one of the fields and Randy would use a lot of this type of licks in his playing. The cool thing about this lick is that it combines two scales in one. So first I'm going to play it through, then we're going to break it down. So it goes like this. Alright, so we're in a key of A major or F sharp minor in this case, uh, relative keys. So um, we have the lick which is combining the F sharp minor scale and also the blues scale. So the lick itself goes like this. We start off with the bend on the fourth fret of the G string, then we go to high uh, I'm sorry to the B high E second fret. Then we have two pull-offs here on the B string, five to the second and then third to the second fret. Then we go to, so this is part of the uh, sort of pentatonic going into the minor scale because of that note. Then we have fifth frets on the G string, so we're going into the blue scale now. Fifth fret on the G, then we have second on B, and then so this is uh, the uh, typical blues here um, notes. So five four two on the G string, then we go to the fourth fret on the D string, back to the G string second fret, then on to the D string fourth to the second, then we have four on. A, back to D 2nd fret, then we go 4, and then we have these uh, 4 pull-offs from the 3rd fret to the 2nd on the A string, and then sliding into the 5th fret on the, a, on the low E string, into the A note. Okay, so that's the whole lick. Slowly, it's gonna be like this. Okay, now a little bit faster. And up to speed. Now this lick is played uh, quite at, at quite fast tempo, so I suggest you slow down at first obviously to learn it and then try to get it up to speed. Alright, so to use these type of licks in different keys, what you have to do is you have to find the first position of the relative minor pentatonic scale. So let's say we're in B minor or the relative uh, uh, D major. So we transpose everything into this position, into the uh, first position of the B minor pentatonic. And now we just play the lick starting in this position. So it's going to be like this. And that's it. Alright guys, so that was it for this lesson. I hope you liked it. Please give it a thumbs up if you did like it. Also, leave your suggestions regarding any leaks you want me to transcribe in the comment section below. Thank you very much for checking out this video. Comment, share, subscribe if you're new to my channel. Don't forget to visit guitarforce.com for more guitar related stuff. In the meantime, I'll see you again. Take it easy and as always, let the force be with you.